If you want to know how to apply ceramic coating for your car, in today's video we're going to test this professional ceramic paint coating. And in today's video we're going to review it, we're going to test it, and we're going to see how hard it is to apply it to the car paint in today's video. Coming up next. Okay, this is what it comes inside of the box comes from some information about the ceramic coating about Ceracote company in here and more information about the this ceramic coating and about their products in this uh, this pamphlet and in the box <laughs> it comes with two bottles that's amazing i think one bottle is enough for one like a sedan car regular car but if you have a truck you will run maybe with one and a half bottle you have a big truck comes with the applicator that's amazing so this one they say this is the easiest coating to apply so that we are going to find out that today so let's go with the installation let's see how to apply this uh, ceramic coating okay the first step is to wash your car you can rinse and wash it with a soap if you can use a dish soap to remove any wax from the paint of the car. And the next step is to use a clay bar to clean any dirt or grime stuck to the paint because you don't want to put a ceramic uh, coating on top of a dirty paint. So clean it really good, the whole car do a clay bar cleaning. And if you have a car polisher, you can polish your car, but this is optional, you don't have to do it. I don't have a polisher so that's why I'm not gonna do that but I'm planning to get one in the future and the last thing just use isopropyl alcohol to clean each panel before you apply the ceramic coating on the panel this ceramic coating you can apply it on paint PPF paint protection film plastic glass but not for matte finishes because it will make the matte finish glossy okay we're gonna start with the application and we're gonna use the applicator but before that we're gonna check the bottle real good before we put the coating on the applicator and after that we're gonna start putting the coating on the applicator like this and after that we're gonna start applying the coating on a two by two feet area in a cross hatch pattern left to right and up and down and I'm gonna continue doing this until I finish the whole hood. And now we're gonna wait five minutes to let it dry. So we're gonna put a timer for that. And after the five minutes are up, you can see the beading effect of the coating. Uh, you can see it, the little spots right there. That means the coating is ready. And now the next step is to use two microfiber towels one microfiber towel i'm gonna use it to level the coating and the other one i'm gonna use it to buff it up so let's see how hard it is wow <laughs> it's super easy it comes off super easy and it's starting to look more shiny than before <laughs> now i'm gonna use the other microfiber to buff it up the coating and just like that the hood is done Repeat this process for the rest of the car and the other panels. And look at that, looks super shiny. And one amazing thing is that you only need two hours for curing time. And before you wash it, you have to wait 24 hours. That's amazing, only 24 hours of waiting. So now let's do the water test and let's see the hydrophobic reaction. Okay, this is two days later. <laughs> I waited a little bit longer, but now let's see the water. I have my water hose here and let's see the hydrophobic reaction on the hood. <laughs> That's amazing. <clears throat> Look at it. The water is light. <laughs> 
<laughs> Amazing. Okay, guys, that was the Ceracote ceramic coating. The water beading is amazing. The price is amazing too, and it's super easy to install. Okay, the link for this product is gonna be on the description of the video down below if you wanna get it. Okay, but thank you for watching. If you found this helpful, please like the video, subscribe for more videos like this one. Thank you for watching, and see you on the next video.